Hi guys, so today we're going to talk about how you can inject an insulin using a syringe. Please watch the entire video before injecting your insulin. Your healthcare provider may advise you to use insulin to control your sugar levels. So you will need bottle of insulin, sterile insulin syringe needle attached with wrapper removed to alcohol wipes or cotton balls and a bottle of rubbing alcohol, one container for used equipment. So you have to wash your hands with soap and warm water and dry them with a clean towel. Remove the plastic cap from the insulin bottle. Roll the bottle of insulin between your hands two or three times to mix the insulin. Do not shake the bottle as air bubbles can form and affect the amount of insulin withdrawn. Wipe off the rubber part of the top of the insulin bottle with an alcohol pad or cotton ball damped with alcohol. Set the insulin bottle nearby on a flat surface remove the cap from the needle Draw the required number of units of air into the syringe by pulling the plunger back. You need to draw the same amount of air into syringe as in insulin you need to inject. Always measure from the top of the plunger. Then insert the needle into the rubber stop of the insulin bottle. Push the plunger down to inject air into the bottle. This allows the insulin to be drawn more easily. Leave the needle in the bottle. Turn the bottle and syringe upside down. Be sure the insulin covers the needle. Follow those guidelines. Ask your doctor or nurse or healthcare educator which size you should use. Know the size of each injection. Inject at least one and a half inches away from the insect last injection site. Try to use the same general injection area at the same time of each day. For example, use the abdomen for the injection before lunch. Note the abdomen absorbs insulin the fastest followed by the arms thighs and buttocks keep a record of which injection sites you have used remove the cat needle with your other hand gently pinch a two or th two to three inch fold of skin on either side of the clean injection site Inject, insert the needle with a quick motion into the pinched skin at a 90 degree angle up, straight up and down. The needle should be all the way into your skin. Push the plunger of the syringe until all the insulin is out of the syringe. Quickly pull the needle out. Do not rub the injection site. You may or may not bleed after injection. If you are bleeding, Apply light pressure with the alcohol wipe. Cover the injection site with the bandage if necessary.
dispose of the syringe and needle, do not cut the needle. Drop the entire syringe and needle into your container for use to sharp equipment. When the container is full, put the lid or cover on into and throw it away with the trash. Do not put this container in the recycling bin. Some communities have specific disposable laws. Check with your local health department for specific disposable instructions in your community. So that's all for today guys. I hope the video was useful and if you found it useful do not forget to share this video and if you're new to this channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you will be notified in my next video and also if you want to know more about how and where you have to inject your insulin the sites of the injection please do not forget to check my social sites I have linked them below so you can check on that side as well so you will know more about it thank you and please do not forget to subscribe my channel thank you